Hey guys, welcome back to Commander Versus. We have a very special four-player Fate Reforged theme video for you today. As usual, I'm your host, Justin Parnell, joined by my good friend, Imperial Recruiter himself, host of 60 Minutes, 60 Minutes John Suarez. Yes, um, yeah, 60 Minutes, all right. It'll probably be a little bit shorter today. It will be. We've got dragons today. No Imperial Recruiters in that deck. Unfortunately not. How's it going? I'm Stephen Green, and... Beside me, we have uh, the CEO of Morton Salt, Wesley Wise. Hello. What do you got over there? I see I an Ugin. I do have an Ugin. I feel like everyone should have an Ugin. Wait, you have an Ugin? Here. I have, have an Ugin. Ugin. I don't have an Ugin. Well, what do you have then? Everyone comment about how terrible he is for not having an Ugin. You guys can call me Nickel Bolas, because I'm going to be killing all the Ugins. But with, not with Nickel Bolas. Who's your general? Is this your all general? Right. So as we were saying, <laughs> we have some dragons. Oh, dragons. Dragons. We got dragons. And I have the most powerful dragons. Atarka. That's to be decided. Atarka World Render. Well, It says it in the name. It world does. Render. It's going to rend the world. And in three other worlds. For maybe. Each, for each of my still dragon-having opponents, but maybe less so. None of you guys can play Dragon Broodmother, which is obviously the sweetest dragon you can have. She spits out baby dragons every turn. Hmm. Yeah, that's that's true. You're never going to cast it. Look at the casting cost. Oh, that's true. well, Frontier Siege will help with that. It, Not too it much. Won't, it won't. This says red. No, it's fine. It's like a colorless man. I get two green. All right, all right okay. let's, let's say I have plenty of mana. Frontier Siege is going to let me fight all of the rest of your creatures when I play my dragons. All right, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. If I wanted to put everything in play at one time, I obviously have Genesis Wave, which is the hallmark of every big mana, nasty dragon, huge creature deck. I actually am very jealous that I can't be playing Genesis. Yeah, you should be jealous. There's only one card I'm jealous of in your list. What's that? Dragon Man. The original OG Sarkin Ball. Yeah. He puts dragons into play. He does. He does. The Dragon Speaker may turn into dragons. Sarkin the Mad may blast due to your dragon's power, but he's the only one that puts a 20 power of dragons into play. And he can steal your dragons. Oh, no, that's not good. Well, I think if you play this, he shouldn't get a dragon. Death by dragons? It's, a, uh, it's, only, it's only for... You know, I don't need a dragon. I'm going to have so many. My deck is all dragons. We're playing dragon tribal. I'm playing red. Home of the dragons. You may be home of the dragons, but there's a lot of changelings in green and white. And changelings, they're also dragons. They're lesser dragons. Uh, you could say that. Dragons they're, in disguise. I would call them landworms. <laughs> <laughs> they are dragons. There are five mana, seven, seven dragons in this deck. Well, you looks like you can be making plenty of mana too. You have Frontier Siege as well. I do. As I have you should be. Plenty of green ramp, Frontier Siege, uh, Jugan and Yose, you know, the classic green white dragons. Obviously, we have some Spirit Dragon, unlike you. Don't uh, need him. Well, we'll see. Don't You'll probably need regret it in the end. Don't need him. Uh, then we got a couple of sieges over here, you know, holding it down. Citadel Siege is pretty good. If you it choose. Is. Now, so. I feel like we should... I, I'm going to always be choosing the Dragon's Mode because it's like I don't have a choice. Sure. I'm playing the World Render. I can't choose cons. What does the Dragon's Mode do over there? Uh, at the beginning of combat on each opponent's turn, tap target creature that player controls. Okay, so that's pretty good in multiplayer. It's pretty good. It's yeah. pretty good. Tap down four different, Basically creatures. Three three different creatures. Three times the Siege yes. versus every other Siege because it's going to trigger on every other person's turn instead of just your turn. Yes. It's going to be quite sweet. Steven... Death by Dragons. Yes, Death by Dragons. I guarantee you, everyone here is going to die by dragons. That's true. Yeah, and one of you might not even get the dragon. I think I know who it's going to be. It's definitely me. Yeah. Yeah. I'm playing Kalagon, the Storm's Fury, and that's what I'm bringing, the Fury of the Storm. Hmm. I've got uh, some Lizard Man, and uh, these guys are pretty sweet. you got Zerillion of the Claw, who lets me search my deck for a dragon. Put it into play, it gains haste, and I exile at the end of the turn. So it's like Demonic Tutor plus Sneak Attack for Dragons. Yes. That seems powerful. It's pretty powerful. And then we got Hivis of the Scale, homeboy. He uh, gains control of target dragon, and as long as he remains tapped, I control of the dragon. So he's the Dawkin Dragon sh Scale shackles. Yeah, but I don't <laughs> need islands. No, you just need other people to have dragons. <laughs> Conveniently, it's lining up to look like hmm. people have some dragons. I may or may not have some dragons. Now, judging from the amount of enchantments I see out here, I'm not going to interact with those cards at all. <laughs> <laughs> you don't say, Mr. Black and Red. <laughs> and then I have, uh, obviously, I have Ugin, the Spirit Dragon. Because if you're not playing him, you're not trying. I don't know why 
you would play him. He's a, it's a dragon themed commander. Yeah, video. Well, then I have the only planeswalker who matters, Sarkin the Mad. Basically, with him, all I have to do is put my dragons in play, well, no. and I get to kill you. I don't think you can make that argument, considering we just mm. talked about this planeswalker. I can make whatever argument I want. He's Anyways, not even a planeswalker. He's a dragon. Over to my deck. Whenever we were talking about doing the dragon theme deck, I was like, all right, I just want to make this like the biggest, most fun video that we've ever done. And so I just wanted to put in like a group hug theme deck just to kind of ramp up the power level of everyone else's dragon deck. So we've got a whole bunch of... We obviously, Ugin, because it's dragon theme. Not obviously. It, it's it's definitely obviously. We got show and tell, and we got other other way. We got oh, braids. Show added. and tell, so you can put Ugin into play. Oh wait, no, you can't do that. But you know, I you got, could put in play. I bet I could put all of my permanents into play. You could uh, put Zerilia into play. All of my permanents into play. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, mine uh, too. Hold on. We also have uh, Font of Mythos. We have other Howling Mine effects, kind of help everyone out. I, uh, I don't know. I just want to see some crazy stuff happen with dragons. Oh. I don't really care who wins. It sounds like you just want to have so much fun and make sure everyone else has even more fun. Surely nothing... I'm nef- killing you first. Surely nothing nefarious is hiding up your sleeve <laughs> in that deck over there. Yeah. No, no, you, it's, it's fine. I'm sure it's, it's all just white. very generous, yeah. all lovey-dovey. Let's all have He's fun. He's playing the Colors of Denial. I have to have a way to win <laughs> The Colors of Denial. Yeah. Eventually. You have Ugin, the Dragon Spirit. Yeah. I like that C.O. Morton everything. Saul is playing the, the Soul of Winter, you know, <laughs> keeping himself in business. <laughs> Gotta do what you gotta do, man. See how salty he'll get. All right. Well, I think it's about time to see how salty you get. All I know is somebody's dying to the Xenagos plus a Tarka one shot combo. Bring it. Yeah, What's gonna happen? True. That's probably true. <laughs> Someone nah. will die. Let's roll a die. Just see who goes first. We'll catch you guys in the game. <laughs> 